Well, anytime you talk about closing a bridge in this town, it's a major concern. Yeah, especially for those who travel and use it. Well, that is exactly what's happening tonight over the Allegheny River. And new this morning, John Shumway explains its short term pain for some impressive gain. Around here, we call the sister bridges and the 10th Street Bridge of the Mon is their cousin. But here at the Allegheny River sisters are approaching their 100th birthdays and they'll get there with about everything new. It's an exciting uh, process and these are historic structures and we want to show them off uh, the only uh, trio of, trio of uh, identical bridges in the world. Allegheny County Public Works Director Stephen Hanley says that the five touch is some pretty significant lighting. The number of lights we'll be putting on is 1,000. 1,080 lighting fixtures, and it contains 600 and 1,440 individual LED lights. Now, we're not talking about a few spotlights. These are the artistic images of the future. This would light up the towers, the piers, and the eye bar chains along the structure. And we'll have some linear lights going down uh, from the chains. Colors can be adjusted to what's happening in town, and the work has already started putting uh, light and conduit uh, underneath the structure with some of the wiring. So that work has been completed on the Rachel Carson Bridge and in Andy Warhol Bridge. So now we're moving up to the decks. So tonight, the Rachel Carson Bridge will close at 8 o'clock until 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. And that'll happen each weekday morning. Yes, that does cut it close to the morning rush hour. And with Clemente closed for renovation, that will leave only the Warhol Bridge open. And we'll monitor if there's any issues, we'll make adjustments. The overnight closure on the Rachel Carson Ridge or the Ninth Street Ridge, if that's what you prefer, could be impacted by the weather. So depending how quickly they can work, uh, at this time we're assuming two months. Then it's under closing the Wall Bridge overnights two months. All the Clemente line will be done as part of current renovation. All of it wrapping up. We're looking at the end of uh, next year, so December of 2023. Now, what impact this is going to have on the morning rush hour, we'll just have to wait to see tomorrow and in the weeks ahead. However, if you are coming to a show in downtown over the next couple of months, just know that as you come to town, the Rachel Carson Bridge will be open. But when you come out of the show, it's going to be closed, and you'll have to use the Warhol Bridge as your alternative. John Shumway, KDKA News.